Hi there, it's Elisa from AK Educational Consulting, and I wanted to hop on today to tell you about an app that I've been using that I think is really cool, um, and some of you may be interested in for yourselves, um, but also it can be pretty easily adapted to use at home with your kids or in the classroom with your students. So the app is called Three Good Things. And the premise of it is that each day you go on and you type in three good things that happen to you, three things that you're thankful for. It's sort of a gratitude app, gratitude journaling. And it gives you a place to tell you how you felt about that thing also. Um, going a little bit deeper than, you know, I felt happy or how did it really make you feel when somebody gave you that compliment on the street or whatever it was. So it's super simple, easy, quick to use. So I know this is not great um, visual uh, that, and I know you can't see that really well, uh, but it basically goes one, two, three. You type it in and it saves it sort of as a journal. So, this is great to use for yourself, which is how I use it. Um, but it's also great to just adapt to using with your kids. So when they get home from school or when you're sitting around the dinner table, what are three good things that happened today to you? Um, I know we can struggle at our house with this when, you know, when you ask, how was school? Fine, terrible, good. You get no information from them, right? Um so I have started asking my kids, you know, what is one great thing that happened to you today? Um, you can start there. You can start off with three good things. You can, you know, go straight to three things that you're thankful for. Um, I just like the idea of how simplistic it is. And what we know is all of the science shows that being aware of the things that we're thankful for and actually speaking our gratitude, writing our gratitude for things actually makes us happier, more joyful people. Who doesn't want that, right? Um, also something that you could use in the classroom, whether you do this during a community meeting or a community circle sort of time, what are, what's something that you're thankful for, what's something you know good that's happened to you in the last week, you could use this at the end of the day. What were three good things about today? And choose three different people to share um, something. So again, the idea behind this is very simple, which is what I like about it. Um, but also that we can be really flexible in how we use this in a lot of different environments um, with kids, with ourselves, um, and start teaching them that daily gratitude practice. So check it out if you haven't heard of this app. Again, it's called Three Good Things. Um, it's a free app that you can download. I'd love to hear if you are using it or if you've heard of it or maybe you're doing something similar. Um, what are you doing so that we can get some ideas about uh, other ways that we can sort of integrate this, this gratitude practice with our kids because it's so important and it's really uh, a critical piece of our social emotional growth. So check it out. I'd love to hear from you and I'll see you back here next time.